I was diagnosed with breast cancer in July 2010 and I had a mastectomy, chemotherapy, radiotherapy and septin for a year and when that was all finished I was told you're all fine, off you go. Uh, a year later the cancer came back in the skin but it was more widespread this time and my oncologist said you have to have more chemotherapy. There was a surgeon at the Royal London Hospital who was doing a treatment called electrochemotherapy for skin cancer patients and this might be something that could work for me. To have to go through more chemotherapy, it just felt like another option was being taken away. Um, so to have one, a new one given to you just felt wonderful and also when I found out it was one that I could have over and over again, if that was applicable, it just felt amazing, you know, it just filled me with hope, you know, that I would live an awful lot longer. <laughs> I was out of the hospital by five o'clock and I was given some cocodamol to take. I didn't really need to take them, just at night, because moving around in bed was quite painful. The worst bit of the treatment was changing the dressings. Um, they were quite icky for a couple of days. Um, my children were a little bit disturbed by it, uh, but they got used to it quite quickly. But the, the best bit of it was um, having my first scan. It was three months after my treatment and I had a, a, a PET scan and it showed that all cancerous activity had disappeared from the affected areas. Um, and the gyms are noticeably reduced in size and are still shrinking now, like even like five months after the treatment. Having this treatment has meant that I didn't have to have systemic chemotherapy. So that's five months of not being ill and not having to have that recovery and not losing my hair again. Um, when you have secondary cancer, the number of lifelines that you have available to you are greatly reduced so having one a new one given to you rather than having one taken away is, is just wonderful. My follow-up plan um, at the moment is I see Mr Moyer for checkups and photographs every three months um, and I've, I'm still having regular scans. Mr Moyer has said that you know if it's appropriate and I need it then I can have uh, electrochemotherapy again in the future. At my new hospital um, recently they've actually set up a department specialising in electrochemotherapy there um, so should I need to have it in the future I don't necessarily have to go to London I could have it done at my local hospital uh, which is absolutely wonderful. If I had to have this treatment again I would absolutely have it again because the difference between um, a couple of weeks of changing dressings and four months of being miserable and ill, you know, it's a no-brainer. <laughs> <laughs>